all look so familiar? Because we've destroyed a bunch of them already. The advanced weaponry exhibit is currently undergoing maintenance. We apologize for the inconvenience. This is Midgar, our home, recreated in one ten-thousandth scale. As you can see here, the eight Mako reactors form a ring around the center of our city and keep Midgar running day and night. The Mako which flows beneath our feet is a truly limitless resource. At Shinra, we have developed technologies to extract it and transform it into the fuel and electricity that powers everything we do. Thanks to the miracle of Mako energy, our lives are richer and better than ever before. Mako keeps our lights on at night and made Midgar into the city that never sleeps. The triumph of technology and testament to man's potential. Nothing but a bunch of lies! Except that Mako has made people's lives better. It's made people blind. Blind to the cold hard truth. Even I used to buy into their bullshit. Remembering that makes me even madder. Shinra's cutting-edge technology. Through an immersive visual and audio experience, please relax and enjoy the show. This place is empty. In the 
distant past, our planet was home to a people we call the Ancients. Many millennia before we discovered Mako, these precursors were already pioneering its use. Somehow they learned of the great reservoir of energy pulsing beneath their feet. And once they had, the ancients developed the means to harness this bountiful energy and bend it to their will. The fruits of their labors have survived to this very day in the form of certain kinds of materia. Their scripture, too, has endured. We who are born of the planet, with her we speak, her flesh we shape. Unto her promised land shall we one day return. By her loving grace and providence, may we take our place in paradise. Alas, the ancients themselves are long gone. 2,000 years ago, a meteor brought an end to their civilization. <laughs> but before their fiery end, did the ancients find their promised land? Even now, we have only to wonder. Times have changed, and the Shinra Electric Power Company is committed to changing and evolving with them. Like the ancients, we have harnessed the power of Mako. Are they out there watching us, waiting for us to join them in some blessed corner of the world? A green and verdant land where boundless Mako energy will provide for our every need. Shinra is working for you to fulfill the hope of the ancients and lead us to that promised land. We shall not rest until our dream is realized. Oh dear, a man of my refined tastes running out of butter. <laughs> Short of its proper accompaniment, this tea might as well be boiled pond water. <laughs> possibly have been crazy ass thing made me want to puke and not just because of the presentation but the content too ought to come with a warning that ain't for kids that wasn't just a movie that huge meteor what was that about like I said nothing you should show a kid Greetings and welcome, Avalanche, I presume. 
My name is Hart, and it's a pleasure to meet you. I've come to escort you to Mayor Domino, per his request. The mayor of Midgar? The empty suit that's just a mouthpiece for Shinra? Yes. The mayor of our dear Midgar. The most magnificent city ever built, that Mayor Domino. The Visual Entertainment Hall has been experiencing technical difficulties of late, and he suspected that these difficulties might impede your progress. So what does the mayor want with us? I'm afraid you'll have to ask him that yourself. Guess we're supposed to follow. So what? You telling me the mayor's some kind of crazy bookworm? here. If this is a trap, you're a dead man, you hear? This can't be right. Ah, wonderful. You finally made it. <gasps> I am the mayor of the great metropolis of Mako. Domino, at your service. <laughs> I must say you three haven't exactly been discreet. I wonder who's been cleaning up all your messes. What the hell's going on? Come on, think about it. You've been caught by security several times, walked in front of every other camera, and scared an accountant half to death. Do you hear the alarm? No? You're welcome. <sighs> hmm. hmm. I can only assume your cell wasn't looped in. I am Avalanche's man on the inside. Say what? Huh. Is it really that surprising to you? You've seen where they put me. The mayor of the greatest city in the whole wide world, tucked away in a secret broom closet in the damned archives. The nerve. Those stupid Shinra pricks thought I'd just shut up and accept their treatment. But they were wrong. Dead wrong. Huh. Well, this ought to make things easier. <laughs> we need to break into Professor Hojo's lab. What? Why? You mean you're not here to give President Shinra his comeuppance? We're here to save a friend who was taken. But the President's gonna get his, too, if I have anything to say about it. <sighs> well, I don't particularly care what you end up doing. So long as it hurts Shinra. Great! So, I can get you as far as the 64th floor. Hold up! You're telling me that that's the best you can do? 
That is indeed the best that I can do. But you're the mayor. But you're the mayor? Does this look like the office of a mayor? I'm a glorified librarian, nothing more. They don't even invite me to their meetings. Sorting records and reports, that's all I do. My hands and fingers have more paper cuts than skin. No one knows my pain, my daily torment. They've made me a pathetic shell of a man. Uh, 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 okay, they did you wrong like us, but we'll make it right. So just calm down. Deep breaths, man. Deep breaths. Hmm. Let me see that key card of yours. Here you are. You can now use it to access the recreational facility on the 63rd floor. And then what are we supposed to do? You look for a fellow Avalanche collaborator. Identify yourselves and he'll give you a key card to the 64th. The countersign is... The mayor is the best! Midgar's mayor is nothing less! Uh... Everyone says he's cooler than the rest! Uh... Uh... Just say Mayor to the guy, and if he goes the best with gusto, then you found your man. You got it? If you think you've found the collaborator, say Mayor, and see if he says the best. You got it now? I still can't believe the mayor is working with Avalanche. Would have been nice to know. Idiots at HQ should have kept us in the loop.
If you require additional assistance, please do not hesitate to ask. So can you tell us anything about this collaborator? Certainly I could do just that, but a man in my position must conduct his affairs with discretion. Which is to say that that which has been requested cannot be freely given, if you take my meaning. You want money! Disclosing confidential information entails considerable risk. Due compensation is to be expected. In this particular instance, that would amount to 10,000 gil. Rip us off more, why don't you? The 64th floor is reserved for our executives. The individual you seek is fastidious and well-dressed. This individual likes to visit the 63rd floor to decompress from the stress of the job. That really all you got for us? Oh, are you dissatisfied with your purchase? How unfortunate. Perhaps this will help preserve our relationship. Huh? An expression of my gratitude and appreciation. Huh. That's better. Before you ask, all purchases are non-refundable. The information I provided concerned an executive, after all. You will know them by their carefully cultivated appearance.
So, about this precious promised land of yours. Come now, Aerith, you misunderstand my intentions. I wish only to satisfy their material greed, so I can be left to pursue my great work. Our great work, my dear. You're the spitting image of her now. I regret it to this day. If she had only trusted me instead of trying to run, it could have played out quite differently. What a terrible tragedy to lose the last of the pure-blooded ancients. Though not completely, would you like to see your mother? Albeit through the lens of one of my microscopes. Did you really think we'd leave such a precious specimen to rot in the gutter? We collected and cataloged every last bit of her. Hair, skin, organs, every fragment of every bone. As breathtaking in death as in life. As you, my dear, if Alna was elegance, right down to her cellular structure. <laughs> and there it is, that same elegance. Oh, yes, time for yet another meeting. Sit tight, I won't be long. Here's the 63rd floor, where loyal Shinra employees relax and recharge. It's pretty late, but I bet people are still here dealing with the aftermath of Sector 7. It's their own damn fault. Stay focused. We need to find this guy. Yeah, yeah. Guess I better get working on my conversation skills.
cowards don't care who they are. Avalanche must have used some heavy duty explosives to do that kind of damage. We're told fires raged all night, and you can still smell it in the air. Avalanche must have used some heavy duty Both explosives to do that kind of damage. And travel throughout the Undercity remains extremely difficult and dangerous. Over there is a group of local residents transporting their few belongings by cart. I had some good friends in the city. As you can see, countless homes and businesses remain buried beneath the rubble. We're told fire. They look busy. The plate did just fall. What kind of particular to me? Seeing them like this? Somehow makes me feel a little bit better. The support is getting overwhelmed by calls. We'll have to resort to AI operators. Let's find our contact. Not seeing any security around. One less thing to worry about. Collaborator. I think we just need to start talking to people who look the part. Remember, say mayor. If they say the best, then we have a winner. Today we welcome a special guest, Shinra's Director of Public Security, who has an important message to share with us. <clears throat> Everyone here at Shinra is deeply saddened and outraged by this unconscionable act of terrorism. But at the same time, we will not be cowed by threats or violence. To the people of Midgar, I make this vow. We will find the villains responsible and bring them to justice. Are you listening, Avalanche? You cowardly dogs! Run all you like. Shinra is coming. Do you think the other plates are in danger? Is it true that Wu Tai is gonna attack us again? We should be safe here, right? I wonder how the rescue us. The hell is that? Combat sim. You can use it to train for battle in a virtual space. Does training in that thing really make you better? You work here? I don't recognize you. Can I help you with something? The mayor. Is the best. I was told to expect you. you. Need access to upper floors, right? That's right. Before I trust you with this key card, I need to see what you can actually do. Say what? Do you know what would happen if you got caught? We're putting our lives on the line here. Prove you're worth it. We have a state-of-the-art combat simulator. It can provide a real challenge, let me tell you. If you beat the sim, then the key card is all yours.
Well, well. You gonna call it quits? You're military, right? Can you give me any tips for doing better in the sim? Welcome. What would you like?
won't overdo it. Yes, it's my turn! I've seen enough. I'm a man of my word. Here, this key card will grant you access to the 64th floor. You can use the elevator to get there. Once you're up there, just what is it you plan on doing? We came to get one of our friends. She's being held in a research lab somewhere. A lab? Then she must be with Professor Hojo. It won't be easy to get to her. Access to R&D is limited to authorized personnel only. We'll find a way in. Then where we can find Hojo? A board meeting is scheduled to start soon. It's being held in the main conference room. President Shinra, Professor Hojo, and the other directors will be in attendance. Think they like surprises? We can even take the president as a hostage. Think of the leverage. Try it, and security will be on your asses in seconds. We need to find out what they're planning. So you want to spy on their meeting? Hmm. I have an idea. Head to the men's restroom. You can climb into the air ducts there. They go all the way to the conference room. Thanks for the tip. Cloud, I've been waiting for you. You haven't forgotten me, have you? I'm an intern in the R&D division here. 
I took the liberty of hacking into the executive's private network to monitor your progress through the building. I will support you in any way that I can. I sense a surge in trust. We should keep this brief to avoid suspicion. come up with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information for my research. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions.
You're gonna train in the sim at a time like this? Right? Oh. Holy shit! It's cool, bro. We went through training together. Damn. Oh. So you're still alive and kicking, huh? Some of the guys heard you got smoked, but I told them it was all bullshit. Hey, sit tight, man. I'm gonna go get Kunso. I'll be right back. Old buddy. You okay? Yeah. But you were just... I'm good. Let's keep moving. <clears throat> Come on, why don't you eat something hearty? It'll give you energy. Other plates are in danger? Is it true that Wu Tai is gonna attack us again? We should be safe here, right? I wonder how the rescue ops are going. I think we're all feeling it. What would you like? Counting on you to change Shinra.
want to believe there's something you can do for them, but... You're military, right? Can you give me any tips for doing better in the sim? I want to believe there's something you can do for them, but... You're gonna train in the sim at a time like this? there. So, what'll it be for you today? Is it true that Wutai is going to attack us again? We should be safe here, right? I wonder how the rescue ops are going. Hmm. I think we're all feeling it. Do you think the other plates are in danger? Is it true that Wutai is going to attack us again? We should be safe here, right? I wonder how the rescue ops are going. Are you military? Still thinking. Wait your turn. Trust the narrative is intact? Rock solid. The people have embraced the Wutai Avalanche conspiracy wholeheartedly. I've almost come to believe it myself. Wutai's response? 
So far, nothing. And if those cowards do react, all the better for us and our story. Very well. Then we shall stay the course. If I may, sir, there was one other matter. Oh? A message from our man Palmer. Damn it. Barrett. Yeah, yeah, I know. We came here to save Barrett. That's our first priority. That's right. We only get one chance. Hojo should be at that board meeting, so that'll buy us some time. We need to plan this just right. Do you think that's where Professor Hojo is? Where he should be. Uh, an important meeting is in session. What's the plan? Little bit of recon. Need to find a way to infiltrate that room. You hear the words coming out of your mouth. We just gotta find that bathroom so we can get into the air duct. Ask anyone here. They can point us in the right direction. No thanks. We can find it on our own. Yes, what is it? All right, I'll wait out here. You can't hang out here. Tifa, it'd be better if you waited inside. Maybe, but this is... Oh, never mind. You're right. Oh, thank God. No one's in here. Love to show them what the ones down below look like. Come on, let's just find that duct. Gotcha. <clears throat> Look, I'm... On guard duty. Right. So, can I go with you? Don't want to be here any longer than I have to. <clears throat> yeah, sure. Just follow behind.
I'm sure they're safe. But we live right by Sector 7, and I keep calling and calling, but I still can't get through. I heard that all the phone lines are down. It doesn't mean anything. You sure? Pretty sure. Is this it? I'm telling you, I saw him! With my own eyes, sauntering down the corridor! We don't have time for this nonsense! Ah, he was as close to me as you are now. The, the shock of it made me spill my tea! Enough already! If there are intruders in the building, my men will deal with them. But, Mr. President, sir, I swear to you... Reeve. Sir, 
I have the damage assessment for Sector 7, and I'm afraid the figures are catastrophic. Spare us the doom and gloom. Uh, was there anything else? Uh, well, sir, I've also drafted a that reconstruction not plan needed. for... Huh? Not with the Ancient in our custody once more. Uh, with respect, sir, Two I don't see words, how... words, Reeve. <sighs> Neo Midgar. <laughs> In their promised land, we will build a new Mako powered metropolis. Mr. President, we still don't know for sure that the promised land even. <sighs> <sighs> Professor Hojo. The test results were within expectations. The specimen is somewhat lacking compared to her pure-blood mother, but for our purposes, she should more than suffice. So she can lead us to the Promised Land? Well, Mr. President, that remains to be seen. I would like your permission to secure her cooperation through more forceful means. Forceful, yet gentle. She is a precious resource that must be handled with care. Personally, I've never had a problem with torture. My armory is at your disposal, should you require anything. I had something more psychological in mind. Better to scar the psyche than mar the flesh. <laughs> Proceed as you see fit. However, you will not make the same mistake twice. Is that clear? If I may, Mr. President, I have an idea how we might mitigate the risks. Simply put, we could have the Ancient reproduce. In the absence of a second specimen, we would need to identify an alternative mate. I would start with candidates from Soldier. These would, of course, include S and G types. Quite frankly, there's no telling what kind of properties a crossbred specimen might possess. So... What say you all? <sighs> if there is nothing else... Mr. President! Meeting adjourned. Uh, please, sir! Stinks. Anything? The man in the lab coat. Head of R&D. We follow him. Okay. And then we kill the son of a bitch. Not until he's led us to Aerith. That's the plan. of this very building, who would have believed it? I wonder... Hmm, were I to arrange a face-to-face? -face? <laughs> How I should like to meet their offspring. Ah, uh, but that can wait. First, we must have answers. A simple psychoactive agent should suffice. Nothing likely to cause any long-term damage. <laughs> Let's go. Right.
So first, or perhaps instead, What is this? A dozen bullets in your head, unless you open that door right now. <sighs> you must be the ones who've been stirring up trouble lately. The eco-terrorists? If so, I can't imagine what business you have with me. The President's upstairs. Go on, shoot! Shut up. Keep walking. <clears throat> None of y'all better move a muscle. Do stop pushing. Unlike you, I am less accustomed to physical violence. You'll get used to it. What is it that you want? Our friend. She's in your lab. Really? Tell us where Aerith is. Oh, so she's your friend. Well, well, well. In that case, yes, that might do the trick. Mind speaking up some? It's nothing. Just imagining how she might react if I were to present to her your fresh corpses. I promise, you will regret this. You're up. Don't give up. 
by my predictive models indicate that this force should be more than capable of handling you. Y'all about to learn predictable. We're taking Aerith back. Oh, take her back, you say? Correct me if I am wrong, but did the girl not come here of her own free will? Or do you mean to tell me that she is your personal property? She only came here to save Marlene! I'm afraid you misunderstand. <laughs> but I really can't be bothered to explain. This facility is home to extraordinary specimens that will change the world as we know it. Do try to be considerate. <laughs> Don't overdo it. All set. Get oh. it. Let's make it hot. Oh. Oh. Gotcha. Yeah. Yeah. And you are mine. Heat. My turn. 
Looks like your models got it wrong. Yes. An unknown variable, perhaps. Well, no matter. Reinforcements will soon arrive. But will they get here in time to <sighs> save you from me? Why are you a soldier? Yeah.
the hell was that thing? We need to go. <gasps> Aerith! What the? Come on. So what the hell is it? A fascinating question. Oh. <laughs> Did it just talk? You asked what it is. Hmm. I am that which you see before you. Nothing more. I'd appreciate it if we simply left it at that. Agreed? <sighs> Designation given to me by Hojo. Then you must have another name. What is it? <sighs> he got away. So, we're gonna go get this son of a bitch. You know, Reno, I think you might be due for some R&R. &R. Nah, I'm good. 
What are we going to do about Sector 7? <sighs> we are going to do nothing. Been thinking. Was all that necessary? Had we refused, someone else would have completed the task. We have spared that someone the burden of a guilty conscience. Perhaps that will ease yours. <sighs> yeah, nope. Let's try another tack then. They were a sacrifice to balance the scales. Say what? After everything we'd taken from the planet, we were due to give something back. Do you actually believe that? Does it matter? <clears throat> yes, understood. The VP needs us. Cloud. Oh, thank goodness. You're awake. You okay? Yeah. Where are we? Where I lived, when I was still a child. Look me in the face, tell me that you love me, even if it's fake.